uh, welcoming us and hosting us. Architect po yung may creating art for this afternoon. Uh, good afternoon po sa lahat. So, uh, lipat lang po tayo doon sa, ano, sa lobby ng Quezon Hall para hindi masyado mainit. Okay. Para... Younger legs. Pula pa yung road na to dati. So kapag graduation po, isa to doon sa mga area kung saan nakapila yung mga estudyante. Pago yung processional. Oo, oh, naka nakapila pa din ako dito dati. <laughs> We're the, one of the sites of the academic oval road. no? So ito po yung Rojas Street. Tapos yung kabilang side naman, yung Osmeña Street. So sila po yung bubuo ng oval natin. So ito po yung binabangit ko sa inyo kanina. So ito yung isa sa mga iconic na uh, landscape ng UP Diliman. Yung uh, streetscape niya, lined with acacia trees, na parang bumubuo ng isang tunnel when you look at it from one end. No? Parang covered yung buong ano, road natin. And then kung mapapansin nyo, uh, hindi pa po ito tapos. So, Uh, ito pong side na to, kung saan ako nakatayo ngayon, this is the jogger's lane and then ito po yung biker's lane. So, nag-provide po tayo ng designated areas para dun sa mga users ng ating space. And then, this remains a sidewalk na accessible para sa lahat ng mga pedestrians. So, you, we can walk here at saka dito po sa areas na to. So, mas safe. The center is being built here. Where it used to stand. Nine uses of the art by the yeah, well. So, yung pumakita nyo dito sa kanan ko, mga park goers. 
So meron po talaga tayong mga structures na nililis or pinaparent dun sa mga vendors. So meron po tayo nyan at uh, several portions ng alakad mo Jo, nasa one fourth na tayo ng akado. Ah, okay. Yan. So kalahati na po tayo ng kalahati. Well, uh, And this building to your right is the Palma Hall. So ito po ay isa sa mga pinakaunang buildings dito sa UP campus. So basta po yung mga buildings along the Akado Bay, ilan po diyan yung mga heritage buildings na. So siguro po pag nakakapanood kayo ng balita sa TV o kaya pag pinipicture yung UP, isa isa usually yung shot ng Palma Hall sa mga kinatakita. I'm sure yung ibang mga uh, graduate ng UP dito ang fond memories of Palma Hall kasi isa po ito sa mga buildings kung nasan yung mga GE subjects. So yung mga, parang kumbaga mga minor subjects, dyan po kinukuha. So marami po, halos lahat po ng mga graduate ng UP ay nagkaroon ng class or more dito sa Palma Hall. During my time, somebody jumped off from there and died. Better way. Ah, magjo shortcut tak? Wow. Kamu bete, nak? Some people can maybe go there and then they'll meet us. Okay, five pesos lang po. So, ini pula yang kita tawak nanti na Beta Epsilon Way. So, ini pula yang shortcut, no? From the Palma Hall, well, where students take most of their uh, general education subjects to the College of Engineering at saka yung kabilang side po nung campus. So, with this, hindi na po nila kailangan umikot pa ganun pa. Uh, may shortcut na sila. So, this is newly uh, redeveloped. So, same layout pa rin po. Just that straight line connecting the two ends of the oval. Pero, in-improve na po yung bong area. Like, uh, nila para na po siya and in-improve din yung mga materials. Also before, wala pong mga uh, ramp. So, uh, sign of the times din at saka syempre being responsive to the needs of your users. Kaya meron na rin pinrovide na ramp this time para lahat ay uh, ma-serve ng no, ating infrastructure. So, inclusive. inclusive po. So, we move there para... It's all straight all the way there. Yes. No no steps like this. Uh -oh. Okay. Which is very user friendly. So, do you have a lot of Philippine native trees? Actually, yung pong nando sa other end is a plantation of native trees. Okay. Pero yung pong mga malalaking mga puno dito, most of them are introduced species. Kasi ah, introduced? Yun po yung mga una during mga, the time yes, of... Yes, yeah. during the time. Yes. Before awareness... Panahon ng native... pag ano ng Amerika yun, di ba? Okay. Yung mga mahogany, <laughs> uh -oh. yung pong mga nakatanim sa harap ng palma hall na... Jimena. Yes. Is the... Uh, promenade, the University Promenade. So, ang intention naman po nito is to connect uh, 
let away to the Gonzales Hall. Gonzales Hall or the main library. It hasn't changed at all. No improvement whatsoever. Actually, ngayon po, ini-improve nila yung loob. <laughs> so, baka yung labas ay... Uh, Kasi puro computer na. It should be a media center instead of a library. Ito pong... Ito uh, uh, pong... Uh, I know. There should be. Mga 1980s po siguro. Or 90s. Ah, uh, hindi ko lang po masyado na. Ah, not 80s po. Kasi sa mga Ah, wala pa po. Talagang tumata. Dito po, sa ano, sa main life. That's just the main the way. Wala dito eh, no? Wala. Baka na, 90s. 90s. Pero hindi siguro ganito ka. Ano, hindi. Ah, hindi po. Pathway lang. Hindi namin dinadaan. Sino ka rin dito? So, ito po, promenade na So, this is a... Ako doon. So, may education. Ah, ganun. So, parang may pagka... But you know the more popular one is the uh, variegated, which is. Meron, de ba? Magawa kaya variegated, red, white, and uh, green. With very nice flowers. Hindi po alam yun. Pero hindi siya no native. Pero magawa din siya. Yeah. Uh huh. So maganda siya pa. Oh, it's a design, no? 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 Ganyan yung forma siya, hindi siya, hindi siya makala. So, for landscaping, I guess, maganda siyang gabi. Ang Ayala, ginagamit na yun eh, sa mga... Oo, dito sa UP Town Center. Sa UP Town Center, may isang hilera dyan ng Katmon. Rockwell has also. Ayun, o. Kasi ang Ayala has been using a lot of native trees. Parang yan dito na. partially uprooted ng mga bagyo. No? Kasi nga po, yung akasha, yung form niya, medyo may tendency siya na mag-resist against the winds. Kaya, nagkakaroon ng partial uprooting. No? So, yun po, nakikita nyo, naka na talaga siya. Nakalihis na talaga siya. And normally, kapag nangyari yun, there's no way to correct it. So, you just uh, try to uh, improve the form ng puno. So, Makes it easier to climb. To climb up. Sunken Garden. So, sunken for office reasons. Below the normal level of the road. So, ito po yung isa sa mga pinakamalalaking multipurpose na ground dito sa So, kung familiar po kayo dun sa annual na UP Fair, yung isang linggo na puro concert, so dito po ginagawa yun sa uh, Tanken Garden. Isa rin po ito sa mga practice areas ng mga atin. Kahit po yung mga classes, key classes, dito rin ginagawa yun. ng mga ditches dun sa side. Kung papansin nyo, may areas na parang kanal. So, parang dun din na-direct yung tubig. Pero the general profile of the sunken garden is parang mas mababa siya dun sa kabilang side. No? So, whereas dito, pwede kang bumaba mag-direct-direct sa kapunta sa gitna, dun sa kabila, uh, ano na talaga yun? Uh, 
swampy area na siya. So lulubog na talaga yung pamo pag doon ka nang galing sa kapila. So, this is an, uh, one way of naturally controlling the drainage in your areas. No? Pwedeng mga ditches, pwedeng kumbaga mga landscape pa rin na uh, approaches sa need ninyo for drainage. So, hindi kailangan laging ano, may concrete o kaya may underground pipe. Is this the biggest one? Is this the biggest one? Parang ang laki nyan eh. Nang ano po? Nang... Acacia? Possible ma'am. Parang yan eh. You know that's where I used to study up that in that tree? Sa taas po? Yes. We would walk all the way from the stairs there. Pasakit kayo sa po. Oo. Nakakit nyo pa naman. Yeah, of course naman. Pero like mababa po noon. No, it was like that. Yan po talaga yan. Yeah, that's where we would study. Hindi po kaya yun lang. Ibang lang. Ayun na, kanina naghahanap na estudyante, ba't wala daw estudyante? May time po. Oh, ayan. Uh, kasi yung oras <laughs> ng klase. <laughs> Sabi niya, hindi pa yung puto. Ba't pala yung nakaw? <laughs> Every one and a half hours. Yes. <laughs> Hindi pa rin talaga ganun kalaki. Pero nakikita nyo, medyo sculptural yung form niya. Anong color ng flower niya? Usually po white. Oh. Mine in Koron is yellow. Kalakat mo ang yellow. 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 White na parang sabi nila, like a plato. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, maroon sa gitna? Oh, Or? Okay. okay. Tapos may parang burst. Oo, uh -uh, burst. <laughs> may hairy. Oo. Uh -uh. uh -uh. So, hindi po kayo naliligaw, ibang building na po ito. Magkamukha lang talaga sila. Uh -oh. so, this is the engineering building ng Chore Hall. Uh -huh. Yun talaga yung design. Kasi Diyan ka nag-aaral? Neo Classical. So, uh, pinag, ano na, mini-mirror nila yung mga building. So, even yung dalawang building sa nadaanan natin, magkamukha rin. No, ini saya bina anak kita ni. Ah, ini yang. 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 Ini yang.
konti. May malatod lang talaga itong aswan. Urbanin around 100 trees na puro mga native tree species. So, wala lang pong cables yan, pero most of, uh, all of them are native trees. So, kasi nga po, we're protecting from this indiscriminate planting. Every time na merong gusto mag-tree planting activity, we try to find a place where they need to rep uh, a tree needs to be replaced and then dyan po namin ang pinapatanin. Isang area lang sa mga areas na may ano may stoplight <laughs> The Mans of the Times. But it still looks so serene and quiet. No, but family history is a nice one. Comedy. <laughs> Yeah, bago yung sculpture. Modern na masyado. This is the... Marinyo, is it? Brenda, come here. Tarot ka ng mental, ano, overdose. Oo. It goes all the way to the road Papa, down there. So, itong side po na to, ito naman yung aming film institute. So, yan yung museum. This one is the university 
they're, they're showing now family history for free. Oh, I think I saw it. Ang laman ng may library kaya lumulubog yung ano. <laughs> kaya sangkin ka. So, yun yung sinasabi. So, take a picture, no? With a... Okay, so, we hope you learned a lot from the tour here in UP. Kahit na pag-uwi, sana hindi kayo... Sana, kapag alimbawa, naisipan niyo mga masyal, no? You also consider visiting UP. Especially kung ano yan, na uh, holiday o kaya Sunday. Dahil during those times po, uh, walang sasakyan sa uban. So talagang for pedestrians only yung ating academy. So may mga questions pa po ba? Uh, before po, last, last year lang, ano, pala, ano lang siya, uh, landscaping. But the real story is actually, originally, uh, water feature po talaga siya. So, water feature na ginawang landscaping dahil nga for practicality. And then, uh, medyo nakaluwag-luwag na. So, ginawa na ulit siyang ano, fountain. So, the, the fountain that you see is uh, based on the original fountain. So, even the supplier is the same. So, sila rin yung, so it's not yung, dancing uh, lights or anything like that? Hindi naman po dancing fountain. <laughs> Parang ano, <laughs> ano lang po, <laughs> malakasino, gano'n. Kaya <laughs> akada. <laughs> Pero lighted naman po siya. Pag yes. Service area. Yung yung siya yung area. Ah, uh, meron kami uh, maintenance contract namin, which includes the campus core and uh, some of the nearby na roads. Uh, we spend uh, mga 1.8 million per month. Oh, per month po yun. Yun po yung maintenance cost per, per month. Per month. <laughs> Pero yung buong buong campus core, lahat po ng works including yung pruning, draining, grass cutting, and then clean. So extra pa pag may calamity, like typhoon, ganyan, maraming bumagsak. Ah, kasama na po yung sa contract, kasi resource based po yung contract. Ah, okay. So nakasama na yung sa contract. Meron sir pero nandun po sa may arboretum area, pagtawid ng common. As open space sa po. Wala po, wala na pong mga vertical structures na itatay. Yes po. So kaya po... Na-develop ang area and then after some time gagamitin pala as... Kaya po mahalaga talaga na meron tayong parang pagbabasihan din, like a land use plan na i-uphold in cases of yung mga parang ganong mga, alam mo, nag-surface yung ganong mga ideas, no? we can have something that we can hold on to. Ayan po. Ayan po yun again for a very informative uh, tour. And I hope you saw no, yung examples of the concepts we were talking about during the talks kanina. It's multi-use, it's inclusive, pati PWD access they have. Uh, it, uh, there are so many activities that you can do also. And then there are food. <laughs> stalls also. So it was a very perfect example to demonstrate your concepts that we talked about earlier. So thank you very much, you. Uh, Architect Bruner, for having us here. And thank you also, everyone, for sticking it out this long. Maraming ang nalagas. Thank you very much for your participation. Uh, it's been a very uh, jam-packed day, no? And I hope it was worth your time to travel uh, very far to spend the day with yes, us. So we thank, thank you very much. It's worth our time. Thank, Thank you. you. So at this point,